six clients in the same day. <laughs> Isn't that magical? Right? So I was told that I didn't believe. We had two clients, I'll give you names, Maruti and NGC. So one day, uh, at City Fort, I used to cross that, I shifted to GK1. I saw this hoarding. And it was supposed to be a Maruti hoarding and I had signed last evening on a Maruti thing. But there was an NGC hoarding. Or some other hoarding, I can't. So I called, I said, didn't I sign this? He's like, is this real? And then I was told, by the way, it was changed in the morning. So I was told sometimes they were so proactive they changed it three four times in the day. Take pictures and those would go to clients. So I am from that era of outdoor advertising. I don't have to tell you which firm it was. The firm is gone out of business. It was called uh, run by a Sikh gentleman. Sikh, not Sikh, as in S I K H. Uh, Amrit Pal Singh. I don't know what he does now. I haven't met him in many years. So that was my introduction to outdoor. And then I met some great people. Mr. Balakrishna, you were in. Thankfully, not in outdoor at that time. Uh, but point I'm trying to say, I was asking Pavanji, where is the we do a pitch Madison advertising outro? And in most domains that Exchange for Media evangelizes, some of the issues have remained there, some issues have moved forward. But in the outdoor industry, what is worrying today is when we meet that the size of the outdoor industry is not growing. It's less than 3,000 crores. Uh, there's still no measurement mechanism in outdoor. Right? Uh, Media owners are not investing in outdoor. Now, who should invest? I was asking for the right here, media owners. Technology integration, uh, the only reason there is a traffic jam is because people are looking at outdoor. You know, right? And that slowed down the traffic. On a serious note, you know, today we spend time on our screen. We are all screenagers. We are not teenagers. How do we integrate technology deeply? And it still hasn't happened. And again, when you would talk of a unified measurement uh, mechanism, Integration with other media. Still low because you know agencies still operate in silos, outdoor guys uh, have moved up the value chain. Also, there I say the yields are going down, and I checked that with Pawanji. So if you look at the outdoor industry, it's not really growing. I've made my mission before the next year neons, we will work throughout the year, and I will not I will video. We make sure that we are a catalyst in growing this industry. We just don't do a conference. An award, and you know it may it may mean various things in terms of training, in terms of working with your association to bring up a, a you know a measurement, you know creating an editorial push towards creating a measurement mechanism. Also, the entry barriers in outdoor are very low. Traditionally, if you had relationships in government and you could do wheeling dealing, you would get outdoor contract. I don't know if it has changed or not changed. I hope it has changed. Again, uh, that's a key skill. Right? Now, what what are my three solutions for the outdoor? I'm not from the outdoor industry, so you know more. I'm just saying as an outsider, I come from an even tougher industry. It's called print, okay? Magazines, that too. But I can tell you that in India, magazines will be there next five years. It could be 10. Our business world site is 20 million traffic and fairly decent revenue. But anybody who comes for coverage, wants the coverage in the magazine, which is only a lakh and 90,000 copies, and that is 20 million, 17.6 million, 35, 9 million units. So print is not going to go away. Uh, but I, so I understand your pain. And again, magazine is not going. But I can tell you that individual players in that segment are doing well. Now, could you be that individual player, the voices in the out of home system who can outperform the market? Uh, about, so one is about kind of, I believe that the outdoor industry is punching below its weight. So how does it punch at the right way? And I'm sure today's panel discussion and some of the work that gets awarded will give you a direction. Second about leadership. Any domain, any company, the country, parties, everything about leadership. You have the same party in BJP that had so many MP but still was not punching at its weight. Look at where it is today. So I think they're the leaders of the outdoor home industry are here. They need to introspect. What do they need? Some of you are promoter. Some of you work for very large companies. At the end of the guy who runs the companies has to bring investment. That's my job. Everything else is secondary. Third, so is technology. You can't talk any business. You can't talk of media, magazines. If you don't talk about technology, I can tell you that 
again I said I am not up to date on the outlook, I consume it, I know a little bit about it, I don't know enough, but I still believe that the technology innovation and integration is very sporadic, it is in pockets, it hasn't, it hasn't become the norm, the integration with this screen hasn't happened in the way it should happen. So I think if these three things change, the, can we together in this room set a target of going, growing to 5,000 crores, which we should have, we have looked at last year's natural progression, we should have been at 5,000 crores. I know demonetization would have done its then and again outdoor and advertising in journal and you know television advertising to the tune of 10,000 crore got postponed. So of course out of home will have some impact. Mm -hmm. So I hope over the next one year, two years, we as exchange for media are able to editorially get into it more detail. We are read by marketers, so hopefully we can make a difference. We can do more reporting on out of home. We should, I realize that we do lesser reporting than we used to, uh, because possibly we are more seduced by digital. Uh, I think we'll talk about out of home and digital, that's what we will do. As regards the awards, I can tell you these are the most honest awards. I don't have to tell you. This year we got 350 entries, we had 22 categories, 15 awards being given away. You had marketers as part of the jury, so absolutely honest process. I can tell you that in any domain that we work in, Krishna, you've been part of some juries, you know that really we are custodians, we don't push our agenda, we don't have an agenda, except what is the agenda of the industry. So today's winners are people who are doing great work within the out of home industry. As Suparna said, we will showcase it using our platform. In the next 40 minutes, the, the Minister of State for Information and Broadcasting, an Olympian, a sports person, uh, will be here. Sports is the ultimate level of performance because the Nokia said once either he scored a century or won a medal, why you didn't win or why you got out doesn't really matter. I hope uh, with that spirit that the minister will bring today's awards and today's deliberations will be something that you will take back. I, I really, I, when I came at 4.30, I told Suparna that my vision for this domain is a two-day conference, global leaders being here, and we tried doing that some years back. We brought one of, in your last one, you brought one of the global CEOs in. Uh, bring leaders that can impart training, so it's not just half day. Get everybody who matters, get 50, 60 large advertisers, make sure matchmaking happens. So that's the vision that we have. And I promise you over the next year, I'll try to drill that. I don't run exchange for media as long, but in this domain, I'll try to work with Nawal and Suparna and the editorial colleagues to make this happen.